Hello guys, my name is Ariel and this is my channel. Uh, don't mind all the nerdy stuff behind me. I'm a bit of a nerd. Uh, what can I say? Uh, yeah, so after working almost four years for a company, I was terminated. So I decided to take my CDL and uh, get things rolling, literally. <laughs> so I went through the unemployment office. Uh, I've been unemployed since uh, I got laid off, terminated. I looked around so far, but uh, I decided to go with the unemployment career choice program, which um, pays for my city out basically. So I went through there, uh, and on March 14th, I passed my last, my driving, my parking, and my uh, road test. So. I got pushed back about two months just because uh, one, it was snowing, um, and the other one because uh, I'm also I also took a bus Airbus uh, Class B, so I have a Class B Airbus endorsement, and I have a Class A with a hazmat tanker and air brakes, and you know, yeah. So after looking for a little while, uh, I applied for two of the companies that, uh, they came to the school. Unfortunately, uh, one of them didn't accept me because, well, uh, my physical conditions were being chunky basically. And they said that I needed a sleep apnea test, which is bogus because you just go in because of my size. Despite that, I, that I sleep like eight hours, or some uh, you know, a day. The other company didn't take me because I needed six months of current work experience, and because I've been unemployed doing the CDL training, uh, I wasn't. After you know, I started. Uh, I stopped looking for it temporarily until I finished the school. So because I didn't have that work experience. A six months current work experience they didn't want to touch me so the other one i apply um i didn't get no no answers so i moved on to the next one so basically the fourth time the fourth company so far i have orientation on the 25th they're all gonna send me to uh the school i live on sunday most likely be there, get ready, get prep to start on Monday, uh, the 25th at eight o'clock in the morning. So I will go through orientation. I already have my CDL, so I don't know how the process works because a lot of the companies that I've checked, you know, they have their own school. So, and you have to go through their school and yada, yada, due to the process. But because I have a CDL, uh, class A, I don't really need to go through the school system from the the job itself so uh, I'll document how I go about it from the perspective of a CDL holder a new driver with a CDL basically and I'll tackle it from there and see how orientation goes yeah I uh, think you guys for coming if you're new well you are new this is the first video so uh, smash that like comment and subscribe